Jeremy Johnson, first uh, MAC championship, correct? Yep. Placement last year. Third place, lost Barlow in the semis. Barlow in the semis, you avenged that loss. Yep. Um, are you guys two and two now? Yes, we are, two and two. You've won the last two, he won the first two. Mm -hmm. uh, that, that match, you were really pushing the tempo. Pushing not a whole lot of shots, but you know, working underhooks. What's the mentality in that match? Uh, you know, trying trying to win a max title. What, what are you going after? You know, uh, we wrestled this year. I knew he, this gas thing is as good as mine, and uh, I just knew push the pace, push push the pace. I knew it was going to pay off in that. Is there any doubt in your mind? You know that you can't. You, you're probably going to be a top five, six, seven seed type, maybe top eight mm -hmm. um, seed at the tournament. Is there any doubt in your mind that you can't do that to anyone in the country? I think I do it to everybody in the country. Um, I just gotta stay with my best positions and keep going. Well, do you grab big, burly coach Joel Greenlee and push him around like that? Well, we go three days a week, yep. Uh, I don't know if I grab him and treat him like that, but we get going. Have you ever accidentally in you know mid-hand fight hooked mustaches? <laughs> no, no, this is my first time growing it out and dying it, so. I mean, I did it last year. Oh, you year. dyed it? Yeah, I dyed it. Uh, is it hard looking in the mirror with that? <laughs> Kind of, but you know, it's it's all it's all in fun. I wanted to have fun in here, and that's what I did. Okay, you're the MAC Freshman of the Year last year. Um, you know, moving forward, what's the goal this year? What do you got to do to be, you know, on the podium this year in St. Louis? I just got to keep working. Um, trust in my coaching. They've done a phenomenal job with me so far, um, and just keep working hard. I mean, hard work pays off, and I'm the sure sign of that. You didn't wrestle varsity in high school to what, your junior year? Uh, sophomore year. Sophomore year. So you got into the varsity lineup, I think you qualified once maybe? No. Uh, you didn't qualify to your I, senior year? No, I qualified twice, sorry. Qualified twice yeah. and then you were champ as a senior, yep. Fargo champ. You're not a guy who's was highly touted and a, a, it's kind of almost been a meteoric rise. Yeah. Um, what do you what do you attribute that to? Attribute that to hard work. Um, I couldn't have been here without Todd Haverdo from the Brexel Wrestling Program, those guys. They just love wrestling and they encouraged me to keep pushing, keep pushing. And to be honest, when I won a state title, I don't think he believed it was going to happen. But he told me every day, you can, be a, you can be a state champ, you can be a state champ. Can you believe that he had to wear khakis at the state tournament this year? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Coach Haverdell, you guys got a great program over there. Um, what do you, you know, what's going on here in Athens at Ohio University? You're going to have three qualifiers. Mm -hmm. You know, you had five a couple, you know, the last two years I think you had five. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you guys got to do to, to get back to that five, six, seven qualifier range? We just gotta have pride in our, you know, our training. Um, <laughs> we had like what five freshmen starting in the lineup this year. We're young. We'll probably be even younger next year, but being young doesn't matter. Um, we just gotta come out and have the mentality of just going, going, going. That's the OU mentality. Are you a vocal leader or are you more a uh, lead by actions? I'm by lead by actions. Um, I try to. I've been trying to work on it, but I'm usually too tired to even talk during practice. So. <laughs> I'm more of a lead by example type of guy. All right, Jay Turn, you got anything else for me? Um, go Flow Wrestling.